Ah, uh, yes. What is up, lovers? It is music from your own backyard. That's K Rock's <laughs> local music show. What are you laughing at? I switched right into Radio Voice Man, didn't I? Yeah. Just like that. Yeah. And it's a special uh, edition of Music from Your Own Backyard. Tonight, my special guest is Elise from Dance Hall Crashers. How are you doing? Very well, thank you. All right. Uh, during the next half hour, Elise is going to play us some stuff, her favorite local bands. Uh, but first, let's start off by playing Mr. Blue from the Dance Hall Crashers. It's Carol Q. Crashers 106.7 K Rock K R O Q. This music from your own backyard. I'm your host Zeke, and my special guest this week is Elise from the Dance Hall Crashers. Hello. So, uh, how has everything been going in your world? Tell us what's been going on with the band for oh the past few months and stuff. Um, we have been touring. We did a big U.S. tour with MXPX, and then we went to Japan last week and Hawaii. And we have an in-store this Friday. Ah uh, yes, uh, Friday 5 p.m. Tower Wow in Long Beach free show. Um, and so are you guys are going out to uh, Warp Tour this year? What are you guys up to? No, we're going to do actually uh, some West Coast with Madness. Oh, as really? you may have heard. And how did that happen? Just begged. Begged and begged <laughs> and begged. And they finally said yes. Okay. And, uh, and some Third Eye Blind Dates. And then we're going to go to Europe with no effects. Okay, cool. Uh, some music you brought in tonight. Hepcat. Now, why are you a Hepcat fan and why did you choose to want to play this tonight? Uh, Hepcat is one of the best bands in the entire world. And they're from L.A., and they're amazing. Not to be overstated. Uh, we're going to play No Worries from Hepcat. Here it is, music from your own backyard, the world-famous K-Rock. Oh! 
K Rock K R O Q is music from your own backyard. I'm your host Zeke, with our very special special guest Elise from the Dance Hall Crashers. And Elise has brought uh, a few things in that she likes locally. And uh, we're gonna play the Muffs now and uh, talk about how you got introduced to the Muffs. Uh, the Muffs should be huge. They should be several several platinum records over. I have no idea why they're not, and I've loved them for years. They've had like what three records now? Yes. And they're amazing. Okay, so we're going to play uh, Lucky Guy from the Muffs. And remember, uh, Friday, 5 p.m., right? Tower Wow in Long Beach. It's going to be a free in-store from the Dance Hall Crashers. All right, here's the Muffs. It's the world-famous K-Rock.
Did I miss something? What happened? I didn't get my headphones on. <laughs> oh, no worries. We missed everything. Oh, okay. That's okay. Uh, anyway, it is 106.7 K-Rock, K-R-O-Q. That was The Muffs. It is music from your own backyard, and uh, my special guest tonight has been Elise from the Dance Hall Crashers. All right, 106.7 K-Rock, K-R-O-Q. Yeah, you, you always have to have that music on whenever you talk. You do, because, you know, if you talk over just dry air, you know, it sounds so it empty. Sounds and, cool. And you sound like radio voice man when you can talk over a beat, you know. I'm going to do the radio voice now. You got it deeper. There, we're taking it away. There. Okay, we'll okay. do this whole break just like this, okay? Just for you. Okay. I don't think I can get any deeper than this. <laughs> I am female. <laughs> okay. Uh, Elise from the Dance Hall Crashers is my special guest on Music From Your Own Backyard on the World Famous K-Rock. And uh, so now, how long has Honey, I'm Homely been out now? It came out in September, I believe, of 97. So now, looking back now that it's been a little while, you had time to digest the record, how do you mm -hmm. feel about it? We think it's snazzy. <laughs> we think it's a great record. We're, we're really happy with it. Okay. It's, it's our favorite so far. We've got three, and, you know, we keep liking each one more and more as we go. Okay, how do you think, though, the sound of your band has changed from maybe, like, the f from the first record to now, and where do you think it's going from here? Well, uh, the first record, we were 18 years old, so we learned how to play our instruments a little better <laughs> since then. <laughs> and uh, also, the first record, it was really traditional. You know, it had a horn section. It was much more ska than it is now. Now it's got a lot of different influences, so. So we advanced to three chords instead of two now? Uh, we've got a lot of chords. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, I'm just teasing. Okay. Uh, so another song we're going to play that uh, you chose, All Mine. Do you want to talk about what this song is about? Uh, this is the first legitimate Dance Hall Crashers love song, actually. Because all of our, I don't know if you know, if you read our lyrics carefully, but we have a lot of anti-love songs and a lot of boys are bad songs. Why, do, why, do, why is that? Because boys are bad. <laughs> <laughs> no, we just, Karina and I have had a lot of, a lot of really interesting um, relationships. Um, but I actually wrote all mine uh, for my husband, which oh. is very sweet. Okay. Yes. So this is to him. Would you like to throw out a dedication to him? No, stop. <laughs> <laughs> all right, this is All Mine from the Dance Hall Crashers uh, without a music bed. It's Zeke on the world famous K Rock.
backyard. Backyard. Flashback. Uh, Zeke, uh, music from your own backyard, K-Rock's local music show, and I'm here with my special guest, Elise, from the Dance Hall Crashers, in uh, Friday, 5 p.m., Tower Wow in Long Beach, playing a uh, free in-store with yes. K-Rock. Pick up the new, shiny, nice, swirly K-Rock sticker. Okay, uh, a special treat, Elise has been kind of sharing tonight what she's excited about locally. Uh, Unwritten Law, an advanced CD that's not coming out for a while, right? Yeah, I have no idea when it's coming out. It's coming out sometime between May and December. Okay, now you're choosing a song that you were telling me earlier is kind of a nice heartfelt song. Yes, this is a very sensitive Unwritten Law song, because obviously they're a punk rock band, and, you know, they don't write sweet little love songs, but this one is wonderful. This is a song that Scott, the singer, wrote for his daughter. Okay, it's called Kaylin. Here is Unwritten Law, uh, music from your own backyard on K-Rock. Well, it seemed like yesterday When the world was looking dark It felt so cold and gray And why the hell am I even here? What's the purpose? All I feel is guilt and hate and fear Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah Hey, little. 
whenever you're near Just stay near We'll be alright, yeah, alright Unwritten Law. Yes. Yeah. That's a great record, by the way. Okay, uh, the song was called Kaylin, and it was from Unwritten Law's uh, upcoming album coming out. You don't know when, but... Yeah. Okay. You're just laughing at me the whole night, right? <laughs> <laughs> it is 106.7 K-Rock, KROQ's music from your own backyard, and Elise from the Dancehall Crashers has been my special guest. Thank you so much for coming down. Oh, thank you, Zeke. No, thank you. <laughs> um, Friday, 5 p.m., Tower Wow in Long Beach. Uh, join the Dancehall Crashers for a free in-store with uh, K-Rock. And the last song we're going to play tonight that you brought down is uh, No Effects. And yes, we're going to overlook the fact that they're actually not from Los Angeles, but Eric. Eric Mel Melvin still lives here. And yes. Mike used to live here. And I think Eric Sandin still lives here. Yeah, Eric still lives here, too. Okay, all right. So they just go back from tour. They need a nice welcome home. Okay, okay. Well, and, and plus, you know, Melvin's has great food. So. Exactly. Yes. I recommend their breakfasts at Melvin's. It's good stuff. And go see hi to Hyam. Hyam's a nice waiter there, if you ever yeah. see him. Yeah. Okay. He's a friend of mine. All right. Good. Anyway, that's going to do it for uh, this week's show. You heard, uh, of course, the Dancehall Crashers, Hepcat, The Muffs, THC, uh, Stray Cats. And here is No Effects uh, doing It's My Job to Keep Punk Rock Elite. On K-Rock. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now. <laughs> yeah, it's K-R-O-Q. <laughs>
phone number and stuff too. For more info on these bands, contact Seek at the world famous K Rock.